Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I've got a little unboxing. You know what I'm like with my bargains. And I've been using that Vipon app again. V-I-P-O-N. Um, it's an app where you can get uh, reductions on different shops. And you get coupons for different shops. Um, and yeah, uh, this one was from Amazon. So I thought I'd just quickly show you what I've got. Okay. This is a tiny little light pad. Okay, so we've got quite a bit in this box. Let's get uh, all the bits and pieces out and have a look. But it's the light pad that I wanted because it's a little one and it comes with a little pack, a battery pack. Okay, so it is a very, very tiny A5 size light pad. Okay, that's your instructions there. And that tells us the model and everything. And it tells us uh, features power USB cable, bright eco friendly. So let's have a look and see this notepad. It is a little one. And what I thought was, if I'm going away, rather than taking my big light pad, I would take this little one. And I think with the coupon, this cost me about five pounds and everything else came with it, which I thought was brilliant. I would have paid that for the little light pad. As you can see, it's 20 centimetres that way by 13 centimetres that way. So I don't even need to measure it. It's got its own measurements on. And it's got, oh, look at the size of that. A nice long cable, look. Yeah, it's really good. Uh, I wonder if I can measure that. If I measure half and double it, let's see how good my maths is. <laughs> so it comes to about... 29 30 that's 29 inches that's 58 inches or about 70 about 140 about 150 centimeters so yeah a meter and a half roughly so that's a really good cable let me see if i can find my plug down here plug this in here okay so it's a little teeny tiny one i just thought it was so sweet oh look that's come out already i haven't put it in yet it's me not framing putting it in right okay let's plug it in down here see if i can oh, reach the plug oh, without knocking everything over but nearly under my desk fighting for a life <laughs> i've just got a usb plug down here and i just can't get to it there it is Okay, yeah, we're on. We have blue light for go. And, oh yeah. Ooh. That's got some funny marks on it. Oops, it's just the top cover. Oh yeah, it's just the top. So, oh yeah, it's just the grooves in the paper. Phew. Just take that off and we'll take that off. Okay, so we've got one. Oh, and it fades on and off. Let's see. If we just got one brightness level then, let's see. Oh, it fades on. Yep, so it's just one either on or off, which, fair enough for the price, that's fine. Oh, I like the way it fades off, that's really good. So that's your little light pad. Uh, yeah, um, I just thought, you know, if I'm going away, uh, I'm not going to be able to take my great big magnifier with me. Um, I can always use my magnifying glasses again. They're a little bit smaller. So, yeah, I do have these magnifying glasses and these have a light on as well I won't dazzle you with the light but you can, I think you can just about see there yeah it's got a little light on there so I do have my magnifying glasses with the light but yeah just thought the covering that's brilliant now it does come with this little power pack so let's see ah right so it's a battery powered one okay so if say I'm in the car or went on the aeroplane even if we ever get a chance to go on aeroplanes again uh, or even on a train or whatever um, then yeah I mean I do have quite a few hospital visits these days so you know sat waiting at the hospital maybe I certainly could have used one of these when um, Paul was in hospital two years ago and I was sat in A&E for uh, sorry sat in ICU for like five and six hours at a time Um, we've got a little on off switch there i don't know if you can see that on and off i'll have to get some batteries and try this we've got the usb there 
so yeah you would plug the usb that's in the power socket at the moment into there so it comes with like a little battery pack oops so that plugs into oh, i always get usbs the wrong way around why won't this go in it does go the other way what was i doing that's it oh do you frameless frame so yeah i just thought that was quite handy and obviously it's the standard cable as well i mean i'm not sure how long this would last on a um a bigger light pad if you wanted to use it on say your a4 or your a3 light pads but uh, certainly if there's a power cut and you're in the middle of diamond painting, you could use this. I mean, you can buy rechargeable batteries. So I dare say it will take rechargeable batteries, but read the instructions and just double check before you do use them. So yeah, I'm really happy with that. But let's see what else we've got. So I've got some labels, always handy labels. One of these great little pouches, which, you know, the light pad won't fit in the pouch, which is strange but okay i do keep pet my drills in these um for when i'm kitting up and things i do like to use those now there's these strange little storage containers and uh, i've not really found a use for them to be fair um i mean they are you know well they're not very big um but they're very secure you know the lids don't come off um well they don't no they don't come off but i don't like the fact that they're black oh the lids do come off ah <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fantastic talk about timing that is just wonderful so yeah um let me see if I can just get this back on. Oh, that is just too funny. No, um, yeah, I think. <laughs> I'll have a play about with that later. I think they do just snap back on, but I don't want to break it. Um, but yeah, that's just really funny. The lids don't come off and I just pick it up and it drops off. <laughs> but I mean, it, <laughs> if you've got any ideas of what to use those for, let me know in the comments. But as I say, I've, I've got a few of these from uh, various different places and I haven't used any of them. I did start putting my special drills in them, but then I found it too hard to see them through the black and then through the plastic. Um, so, yeah. Okay, then what else have we got? Looks like a little tool kit, which is uh, always handy to have. So, more spare pens oh we've got some of the cheap metal tweezers they're okay they're not brilliant they're not i don't use them to be fair i've got my favorite tweezers that i use um and i've got my paper crafting paper crafting goodness me my mouth's not working tweezers that i tend to use for uh, my paper crafts they're actually fishing scissors fishing fly making scissors scissors tweezers oh my goodness i think i ought to go and start again <laughs> yeah they're fly making tweezers that a good friend of mine bought a long time ago for me and they're my favorites so yeah i'll probably just be donating those and um, what have we got we've got uh looks like that's a six placer is it they are the curved ones but they're the really really thick ones and apparently they are harder to use i'm not brilliant at multi-placing and um, it's something i am testing out but uh, as yet i'm not brilliant at it uh that one is a six placer and that one is a is that a ten yeah that's a nine placer yeah that's a nine so we've got a six and a nine placer on those with the squishies just the basic um oh, and that's a four no oh, that's a two is it is that a two that's a two or three no that's a two yep yeah, that's a two placer so yeah so just your basic pens and um, they are handy but again i'll probably be donating those big chunk of wax and then her big pack of little baggies so i think this for all for a set it was about five pound with my cup and i think i paid for it obviously it will vary, um, but I even think without the coupon, I think it was around about the £10 mark, which I think for a little tiny light pad, 
with your little battery pack, which I will try um, and see how I get on with that is really good value. So, yeah, I think that's uh, everything I need to tell you about that. So if you've got any ideas for those, let me know. Um, but other than that, right, that's me done for now. So thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed seeing the video, please press the like button. And if you want to see me again <laughs> and see what I can break next time, then press the subscribe button and you'll be notified when I put my next video up. So thanks for watching. Bye for now.